Like Debo on the beach cruising, pedaling up the street. Call of Duty 2.0 is coming to tap them pockets. But apparently it's supposed to be a stellar opportunity for Call of Duty with an extraordinary lineup of innovations in curated player experiences, what? multi-platform gameplay, uh, mobile game development, a move towards an always on community Bro, and player about? connectivity, and best of all, subscription-based content designed to latch on to your bank account and create a permanent suck hole between your money and Activision's wallet that'll never be broken because you'll have to be subscribed to Call of Duty from now on and pay for the shit every month just to be able to play the motherfucker. A stellar opportunity for who? Your pocketbook? Get your hand out of my pocket! I, I don't know about y'all, I'm not excited about this new era coming in because I'm from the old school back when you could buy something and own the shit. It had a price tag on it. It cost a certain amount of money. It was 40, 50, 60 dollars or whatever. Now they want 5, 10, 15, 20 dollars a month. So now that 50 dollar program, if you keep it long enough, turns into a $500 program. Hell, if you keep it even longer, you end up paying thousands of dollars for that same program that used to cost $50. Oh this is what we're dealing with today. I see that with editing programs. You know what I'm saying? You used to be able to buy the shit. Now they want you to subscribe to it. You're never done paying for it. There's no benefit to us as the consumer with this subscription-based program. That's just a new greedy tactic of these corporations to tap you for more money for the same product that they was already tapping you for before. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing to get excited about. I would say I'm not even going to subscribe to the shit, but you know that would be a lie. You know you're going to have to be subscribed to get all the best content. You already know. And, and you know, I'm going to do it. But I'm just bringing awareness that we, it, it has to come to an end sooner or later. You know, do you, you, you have any idea how many subscriptions you have coming out of your account? I was just thinking about it the other day. All of the Netflix, the, you know, the, the HBO, the this app, the that app, the damn, even Smack. Gotta, gotta pay a subscription every month just to watch Battle Rap now. I'm tired of monthly goddamn subscriptions coming out of my account. I'm sick of the shit. You know? They can't even do, you know, they out here worrying about, uh, you know, extraordinary innovations and curated multiplayer experiences and shit. But you can't even get the bare fundamentals right in the damn game and shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm out here running around Vanguard with four people on the map and shit. It's supposed to be eight people. Matchmaker never fills the damn map up. You know, and it ain't just doing it for me. It's doing it for so many people. The hell, this shit don't even work right. I'm out here calling in dogs. That all the dogs' kills ain't even counting towards my final goddamn score. Come on now, dog. I, I, multiplayer 2019, they got two maps in the game that that when it come up in free for all, it's coming up as goddamn TDM. Come on, man. Been like that for a year. Nobody has fixed that yet. They are putting out job applications and and, and and they seeking people to hire them for all this other shit. But the got it's like it's like working. And it's like painting a car that the fucking motor is fucked up in. You got the motor and the transmission fucked up, but y'all are hard at work doing paint jobs on the car, you know, interior work, all kind of fancy shit. Oh my God, listen to this horn we added to the car. Bitch, the car don't even run right. Are y'all aware of the, you know, the fundamental things? Ain't even working right. And we, they trying to take this shit to a new era. What? God fucking damn it! What the fuck? People, I, I'm sorry, I hate to be the bring up Brad news, but shit, I gotta talk about Call of Duty 2.0, and all I see is darkness. They say they gave you niggas money. How y'all feel about it? Talk to me in the comment section, man. You know, because at the end of the day, I already know it. It ain't. It, it's not a benefit to you. It's never a benefit to you. It's only a benefit to them. So if you, you know, right now you're spending sixty, seventy dollars a year on the game, and you know, we, we used to buy a battle pass for like 50 bucks. They don't do that shit no more. I, you know, because I, it, it, you see, this is exactly an example right there. We, I used to pay $60 a year for the game and then $50 for the battle pass. But I would actually buy the version of the game that came with the battle pass. So I'd save $10. So that would mean that I would spend $100 a year for Call of Duty, right? 
get the game and the season pass, boom, I get all of the DLC content that come with the game. Remember that? Remember, you get $100 from me every year, $100 from every person. If you're lucky, they, they'll buy the, you know, the, you know, each fucking season pass, each, I mean, DLC content drop. There was four of them. They would be $15 a piece. They'd make $60 off of you. Or you bought the season pass, it would be $50. Or you bought the bundle with the game, you'd pay $40 for the extra content. You following along? Yeah, that, that wasn't enough for them. That's why they done moved on to this other shit. Now, I don't even know how much money I'm damn spending out here with this stupid battle pass shit. You know what I'm saying? And it just, it only gets worse. Now they got Call of Duty 2.0 with, uh, with subscription base. <laughs> got us all confused out here. Boy, we finna be tapped like uh, Smokey on, 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 on Craig front post. I promise to God. Y'all better watch y'all wallet, man. But what's good out here? How many subscriptions y'all got coming out of y'all shit? Y'all ready to subscribe to Call of Duty 2.0? Shit, I hope they have a pay to win option up in that shit with, uh, with a, a membership fee that you can pay every month to remove skill-based matchmaking. Shit, I drop a grip on that, boy. They'll get filthy rich on that shit, wouldn't it? How much would you spend for a monthly pass to remove SBMM and get old... Good old maps like the good old days when ping was king, baby. And then nobody give a damn about what somebody KD was or what they did in the last match and all of that dumb shit, huh? That's all they really got to do to make card great again is bring it back to what made it great in the first place. You know, realize that it was your greed getting in the way that ruined it. So there's no way that more greed is going to fix the problem. <laughs> that, that's what seems to be going on here so man at the end of the day bro i just hope that because i see they out here hiring people you know they they trying hard coming up with all these new ideas and shit just i, I just hope that they have a bright enough idea to have a a real card boy overlook the situation the way i'm overlooking this map in this ball turret and make sure that all the decisions that's being made by all these different markets with these different hats on or jiving together and actually working towards bringing card to a better place, a better experience for the people playing the game. That should be number one, not how much money is being made. First, you concentrate on putting out good content, making good product, providing a good service, and then the money gonna come to you. Stop being inorganic and manipulative and demonic and trying to figure out a new sneaky way to sneak more money out of people's wallet. You wanna tap a nigga pocket, put a permanent hole in that motherfucker so it can keep dripping into your account for infinity. You probably hope we forget we even subscribe to the shit, huh? Yeah, I'm hip to the game, baby. But talk to me in the comment section, man. How the fuck y'all feel about Call of Duty 2.0? And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to pimp slap the piss out the like button for your boy. Leave me a comment. And be sure to hit that motherfucking subscribe button and don't miss none of this Call of Duty real shit. It's the murder show. Fuck with me.